bloody military and that guy. idea what's going on. Anyway, let's hurry over to the Galaxy Corporation. Stuck in a cell again. Therefore, hey. to put an end to the long-standing war between Longardia and Draxel, we need to mutually agree to implement military cutbacks in order to drive home the point to the dissidents still pushing for war. People of Longardia, now is the time to lay down our weapons and take our first steps on the road to peace. I knew I'd seen him before. Well, knock me down dead with a feather duster. It's Admiral Bernage. Admiral Bernage? That's right. He's the Commander-in-Chief of the Longardian Army. So what was a big shot like him doing in prison? Bernage is a pacifist, and he's probably got loads of enemies in militant Longardia. Yeah, I'll bet you half a haggis he was put in there by some pro-war zealots. The war. There's no escaping it. Man, she really did a number on you. Crying out loud, you old fool. All this for love. Well, not that I don't understand the feeling. Hmm? <laughs> army must know all about us. Mommy, I'm hungry. Hang on just a little longer, G.A. We'll go get something to eat soon, okay? Uh. Um, excuse me. Please pardon me for asking, but do you happen to know this person? Hmm? Do you recognize him? 
never seen him before. Who is he? He's my husband. His name is Sho. There was an accident at the chemical lab where he used to work, and he was caught in the explosion. He managed to survive, but he's gone missing from the hospital. Uh, Simon, do you know this guy? Uh, uh no, no, I, I can't say that I do. <laughs> no. Thank you very much for your time. Um, if you happen to see my husband, please tell him Miyoko and Chie are looking for him. All right, we'll keep an eye out for him. Thank you. Something bothering you? No, not especially. Oh, uh, I feel a little dodgy all of a sudden. Do you mind terribly if Steve goes with you instead? Huh? I'll be joining the party if you don't mind. Thank you for your patience. How's Simon doing? My senses failed to detect anything out of the ordinary. Apart from his body fat percentage, that is. At any rate, let's get to the Galaxy Corporation. The captain will have our heads if we don't hurry. So there are beasts on this planet, too. Lots of different scenery, huh? Your fault. Now, now, let's just get our galactic travel visa renewed. One more time. ZR KJ1701, the Dorganark. Huh? Oh no. What now? Duh. Have you guys been in prison or something? Don't you know what happened? Huh? huh? I sure did think it was weird. You guys are so out of it. Don't you ever watch the news? Here. We're live at the Daytron factory where an unnamed individual has taken over the computer mainframe but has yet to make any demands. A large number of hunters are coming together from nearby cities to capture the criminal. Daytron's offering a sizable reward for the capture of the terrorist. This is Lucy Dine reporting live from the scene of the standoff. Get it now? All of Zerard's government offices are managed by the Daytron mainframe. That's like a big computer. So, anyway, I'm afraid they can't help you till that's all settled and they get it back up. Sorry. You know, you could always go after the criminal yourself if you're in such a hurry. Here, look at this. Attention, Daytron Corporation! This is wrongful termination, pure and simple. I am totally running out of patience here. 
If you have time to send pathetic hunters in here, you want to give in to my gosh darn requests! I am the victim here! My wife left me and my life became the absolute pit! I demand 200 million zen in compensation for my pain and suffering! Is this the guy? Hmm. It sounds to me like this fellow is taking revenge for being fired. What a pitiful guy. If we manage to capture this guy, we can get our visa renewed, right? Yep. I'd say that's about right. Let's go get him. If it goes well, we'll even get that reward from Daytron. My, what confidence. I'm totally impressed. To get to the factory, just head straight out through the main doors and make a left at the central plaza, okay? Good luck out there! I don't like where this is going. Take a deep breath. We're not on the wrong path, are we? like we aren't welcome in this land. When are we gonna get there? Careful, I sense something strange. Just one problem after another. if you're tired. Inspector Starr, Squad B has vanished. And Squad A's whereabouts are still unknown. Damn it. Chupus Tuki McConnell. They say he's the brightest hacker in the galaxy. This isn't gonna be easy. Who are you? Oh, hello. We're here to help you capture the criminal. Huh. None of the Ace Hunters on Vedan have been able to apprehend him. I'm not gonna waste my time talking with random hunters like you. Get out of here. Uh, random hunters? How very rude! Go on, Mr. Rogue. Set this fellow straight. Huh? Listen, mister. Do you have any idea who you're in the presence of? Well, I'll tell you. The legendary hunter Desert Claw, that's who. Now stand back and behold the mighty hero. <sighs> Wait a minute. You're Desert Claw? I'm so terribly sorry. Uh, <clears throat> in that case, the Daytron Corporation would like to make a request. We would like to hire you to secure the rebel Jupus Tuki. You may name your own reward. 
Oh ho! Being famous has its benefits, eh, Mr. Rogue? Hey, wait a minute, I, I... Fine, he'll accept. And happily. But the Great Desert Claw won't come cheap. Lilica? So you'll do it? Excellent. Jupus has commandeered the entire mainframe and taken control of the factory equipment. He's one to be reckoned with. Stay alert. The entrance is over there. We look forward to good results, Desert Claw. No ordinary fellow could hijack this factory.